All right, Ryan, what match is this we're watching now? Right, this is the last man standing match for the Universal Championship. Okay, now I saw this man on the intro. He said, I'm going to be last man standing. So we'll see yeah. what that standing means. Oh, you're going to capacitate your opponent so severely that the last person can't sit up for the count of ten. So basically, you've got to floor them so they don't get up. Yes. Now, how many wrestlers in this one, Ryan? Kevin Owens. Is that and, him? Yes. Yeah. The Canadian Beardy Broke. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And, um... The reigning champion will be out in just a sec, here we are. There is the man. The bronze. <laughs> right there, CGI. It's quite clever as well. And there is the Who's universal he? champion. A different say of Korean, the world's heavyweight champion. He looks like a clone of Edge. He looks a bit like Edge. Yeah, pretty much. But he's got black hair. He's a um, blood related to the walk so it's like one in in the family absolutely so roman reigns i've heard of this guy from level best i've seen cool. people do paintings of him it's quite famous that belt has been around since 2016. it's not like the ones i'm used to they look a bit more glitzy now mm. it's like his bank for us i think oh yeah that's um or Heyman. who's he Ryan? Oh, the manager. He's managing. This is about how the close families of like Kevin Owens fighting for his family to put the meal on the table. As he like work his ass off to provide for his family. But Woman Reigns is the other way around. Which is basically using his family to win. Does The Rock ever show up then? No, busy being a big Hollywood man. Does The Rock ever come back to WWE? Well, since 2011 and only for like a few appearances. Okay, I meant like as a commentator or something. No, but they do have like a few matches here and there. Yeah, okay. But mostly on Queen Hollywood at the moment. Yeah, well, you were saying about how he became famous totally off the back of wrestling, so he owes them a great debt. Yeah. Right, it looks like the fans don't like Roman Reigns. Of course, he dealt a heel. All right. Big some the company trying to push him so hard as a face, but the audience just not buying it. Unless they've been forced to. Off the back of the Women's Royal Rumble, I don't feel any charm from these two guys right now. I just want to watch Bianca kick ass. I know how that feels. I think no one is going to be bigger like Stoke or The Rock anymore. I say big as in famous. Physicality. I'm not impressed by muscle-bound, angry-looking blokes now. I want to see women wrestlers. So we still haven't had any fighting yet. This is all build-up. They're just waiting for the bell to win. The graphics. Probably this is going to be a short match like McIntyre Goldberg. I don't know. Let's find out. Spend more time staring at each other than actually fighting. Oh, here we go. A lot of hail makers. Yep. Good uppercut there. Go on, guys. Use the ropes. Use the ropes. There you go. That's what we want to see. Oh. Stop. <laughs> he likes that Superman punch. I suppose he's very tall. So if he jumps up, he gets even taller. <laughs> Obviously, they're starting in the ring, but we've seen some highlights. Bang! Powerbomb. They end up outside the ring, I think. Oh, yeah. Come on, Two. Roman. There's a three count that they have to be down. They had to like beat them severely, whether it's in the ring or outside the ring. But then the ref counts three before they get up and that's how they're out, is it? They had to try to like actually sit up before the count ten. Everyone likes to use that staircase, good weapon. I miss the oh, chairs, yeah. used to bash people with the fold up chairs. Yeah, but... Seem to have gone now. <laughs> I'm remembering now Randy Savage with his scepter hitting Ultimate Warrior on the head. You know, yeah. he had these silly gimmicks back in the 90s. The oh, 80s. yeah. Seems like a lot less colourful now as well. Obviously, they're colourful characters, but often wearing black. Whereas in the 90s, it was lots of blues and yellows and reds. Oh, come on, Roman. Oh, it doesn't matter. No! Oh. They always use weapons all the time now. Absolutely. For big time events. Why wouldn't you? If you're playing Mortal Kombat, you're going to grab whatever you've got. Yeah. Go on, Roman, hit me again. <laughs> Which I'm looking forward to that movie. Now they are taking safety precautions of the cushions. Don't take stuff. these stuff to the head anymore. They're finding this out with football in the UK, that heading the ball is very bad for you. And obviously boxing has always had that. But that is your profession. You've got to beat each other up. Yeah. It's the name of the game. Absolutely right. Oh, I figured. Yeah. Oh, 
have that Roman. That's what you get for bringing that and table up. You see that? Oh, so far near the um, screens. <laughs> yeah, can you imagine having Roman Reigns bashed up against your computer screen? That's great. I'll probably say, I'll face it off, you will be my screens. Imagine it's all sweaty now. Can't see. <laughs> yeah. That's going to cost them billions of dollars. Huge global network. They can afford screens now, can't they? Where's he going? Kevin Owens. Oh, yeah. Everyone loves these steps. They always do in this one. Tooth for a tooth. Eye for yeah. an eye. And just wait. They're going to probably, like, spear each other from this table Ooh. in a minute. Oh, my God. He's not going to jump on him from up there, is he? What do you think? I think he is. Yeah, uh, also. Uh, uh, Roman's out of the way, though. Hey, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. So it's the fold-up chair. A nice little reminder of my childhood. And also, no guide like Wendy Savage no more. <coughs> Most of them are dead now. I suppose so. Randy Savage was so colourful in so many ways. They almost seem like very serious now. Stone yeah. Cold Steve Austin set the trend where it's very grumpy looking men who wear uncolourful <laughs> clothing. Yeah. Which we'll probably get to WrestleMania 14 someday. I want someone to bring the Hogan thing back. Someone should go in there with yellow pants on. And I think Hogan is still working for the WWE now. Uh, we don't want to see him anymore. I mean, someone oh. should wear colourful outfits like he used to. The yellow oh. moustache, but then he had the yellow pants. And they were unique. These guys like to wear black. They like their yeah. heavy metal. Oh! Well, yeah, except for me. Well, now I'm wearing yellow. You're very colourful today. Thank you. I think that's just the trend of what the cool people are like now. What WCW did was it made everything a bit more leather pants, rock and NWO. roll. NWO. Yeah, it almost had this kind of Satan worship feeling to it. When I was a kid, it felt really mean that they were wearing black. Because for me, the bright colours were more true blue America. Glad you mentioned WCW. Lord Egg on WCW are on the WWE Network. Yeah, so if I wanted to relive my childhood, I could go back. Or yeah. I could catch up. I could see what's been happening. Yeah. Or, as of right now, a lot of, like, not too much, but a little of from British wrestlers, wrestling from ICW and just the small companies in Europe are based on the network. Oh, on the network. Okay. And that's specifically European wrestlers then? Correct. Yes. All right. Oh, wait. Here we go. They're going to toss him off there. No, not just yet. They've got a few more screens no. to break. Oh, nearly got the stunner there. You imagine the people in those screens are like, I can't see what's happening. Of course, though. Because they're at their home trying to get sick. Yeah. Oh, it's a really good effect, though. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, man. Right, if Kevin Owens gets up from that, I will be impressed. Go on, man. Go on. Well, he's moving. He's alive. You haven't got a lawsuit on your hands, but he hasn't gotten up. Yep. This guy has no intelligence. I want to get beaten up some more. Of course. He wants the championship. Yeah, but how is he going to fight? He's just broken his back. Oh, he's, he's off. Oh, yeah, because um, the camera shots try to follow the action. He'll be right back. Sometimes they fight backstage. Well, it looks like that's what's going to happen. Yeah, if it... Getting the grand tour of the backstage. Different backstage every single show. Oh, we saw this with Goldberg, kind of. Oh, cool, <laughs> there's another ring. It's a bit like finding an abandoned train station. <laughs> yeah, like in Shut Your Mouth back in the day. It's like Ninja Turtles. This is like the final fight. They got their own performance centre. Oh! <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that was brilliant. Just to make it clear, you're down, mate. You're down. We Good. run you over with a golf cart. Oh, he's not going to run him over again, is he? Come on, Reigns. Not really. I'll bring down the cameraman. That was great, though. I think that, I mean, that made me laugh, Ryan. Good. Didn't see that coming. Yeah, because we were just thinking, where's Roman? Oh, he's off getting a vehicle to finish the job. Good stuff. You don't see him. But probably they might show it one of their WWE Network documentaries, which is called The Day of Summer Summer. Okay. Uh, there you go. There's another camera angle of the action. There we are. Oh. That is uh, an interesting sound. Right, so Kevin Owen is grabbing bits of foam to fight back with. I'm not impressed that he's going to win this. Of course, he's like winded out. Yeah. Oh, but Roman's showing And now he's Roman just playing to God. No, he's not. Go on, Kevin. 
and then being a clown. Pummel him, pummel him, pummel him. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, like two wide fighters. I feel like that ladder should be put to use. Yeah, but it's just probably well, just there. It's there to tease us, yeah. Oh, less talking, man. Come on, finish him. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, now he doesn't break. Well, it probably broke his back. I mean, the ring is very bouncy. When they drop guys on the ring, it has a lot of spring. But this thing, God knows. Ooh. Oh! Now the table breaks. There you go, Ryan. And it's an angle. Right. Well, it looks like Kevin's got the upper hand now. Put a pallet on top of him. No! Ah, oh, yeah. Right, so Kevin Owens is getting in his forklift. Roman Reigns is out for the count. And I have no idea what's going to happen, Ryan. What do you think? What would he just do the recreation of Rock and Mankind? Uh, I guess he's going to drop that on Roman Reigns. Or jump off it. Climbing up to the top of the pallet and he's going to jump on him. This looks like it's going to be painful for both men. Let's find out. Oh my god! Oh! Double sort. Jesus. That's I mean, he was totally... already on the count, man. Just pin him already. Wow. Well, it's probably going to be painful for both men. Just stand up. That seems to have woken up Roman Reigns. It's backfired on Kevin Owen, who's clearly broken his back now. Oh, wait. Owen's up. So Owen's on his feet. Reigns is on his feet. Just about. No. So it's the last man standing, isn't it? Yeah. There's got to be over one or both people standing up before the count ends. Right. Okay. In order to win. That's quite a long count. I imagine Roman Reigns will still pick himself up. I would stay lying down. I would give up at this point. You've got the wrong idea, Kevin. You've got him up on his feet. Drop him. I want to punish him a bit more. There we go. He wants to make sure that he's not going to get up again. There is the stage again. Not the glorious entrance for Roman Reigns. Nope. Is he going to put him back in the ring? No, he's just going to toss him around a bit. Okay. Well, look at him. His body is just lighter. Six. Seven. He's heard the count now, and he's like, I better get up. Nine. And he's on his feet. Oh, oh. Superman punch. Superman punch. I'm liking that. Spear. Oh. Maybe the refs are like, look, both of them are out now. Do I start counting or what? He's going to start counting. Oh, One, two, five. I bet Owens gets up at count nine. Clever man. So he's just rolled off. Be bearing these um, stuff take like a lot of punishment. Where are we going now? We'll be near the stage. Roman Reigns been the champion for a long time. Well, since some um, September. Right. And how many challenges has he had in that time? He fought his brother wins, as in Jay Uso, three separate times. Four get Drew back entire at Survivor Series. He won for the Black and Rice for SmackDown. He beats the same guy in December TLC with table, ladders and chairs. And let's see what happens here. Looking to cuff him, I'm not sure what the benefit of that will be because he's got to get him off his feet. Maybe he should have just focused Stunner! on... Stunner! Stunner! Right. Sorry about that. I always say that in a loud... Stunner, stunner. It's a good camera angle for the action. The handcuffs are on. Ah, oh, now that is clever because that makes it difficult for him to stand up. Actually, one time, Cena actually beaten Batista in one of these matches by sedating his feet in the wind post. <laughs> <laughs> what? So Roman's just taken out the ref, which means the count has stopped. Stop the count. Lateral thinking. I'll just stop myself from losing. Can't win now. So what's he gonna do? He goes straight to Superman. He can break out. Or he can help his business partner Paul Heyman just to get the keys. The manager. He came in with Reigns at the beginning of the match, so he's got the key yeah. because it's Roman's handcuffs. Yeah. I like these gimmicks, Ryan. You were saying about someone having their feet taped up. There was a thing with Ultimate Warrior where he had to put someone in like a suit <laughs> and put someone in a onesie. Yeah. I remember that one. Yeah, which I actually got. Um, the last figure I still got of him was with um, the um, Mega Maniacs red, white and blue. Red yeah. And yellow. Yeah. You have a great memory for all this, Ryan. I remember Thank the big you. events, like we were saying, but not necessarily all the little matches. I remember Lex Luthor, by the way. He slammed Yokozuna, and that ah, was an yeah. impossible feat. No one thought it could be done, but he did it. That's it. Use his weight against him. Oh, he's going red in the face. Well, I can. Look. These men certainly earn their paycheck. Yeah, and they 
been through a lot. Been here before. We've got a 10 count. And chances are Kevin will get up before that happens because this will never finish. <laughs> Four, five. Come on, man. Speed up your counting. Give it to Reigns. Stay at that time or the 10 count in. Come on, number 10. It's there it is. Very cool. I didn't see that coming. I thought after Kevin Owens jumped on him, that would be the end. Trust me, there is so many last man standing matches in WWE history. Some of them probably for championship or just some of them to settle a rivalry. Are these two fighters going to be in the Royal Rumble next as well? No, not really. But through a Royal Rumble history, they had people in the Rumble before in the past. Yeah, yeah. Like the most famous one that I can think of now is Roman Reigns in the 2017 Rumble. Because they've already had a fight, it wouldn't be fair for them to have to compete in the Royal Rumble because they're both knackered. If they don't have enough time to feel everyone else in the yeah. Rumble, either they could going to make it to the show or suffer something serious that the person can't compete and take one of their spots. But I imagine, as we said before, there's easily 30 wrestlers, right? They can get enough men to compete. Yeah. So we won't see these two. I think Kevin Owens might need a hospital. And that's Roman Reigns continue his journey on to WrestleMania.